Hi guys, long time no see. Sorry about like the delay of videos. Um, I just moved into uni, as you can see, different setup. Didn't really know like what kind of background I wanted with moving to uni. Um, but yeah, change of background. It's this white sheet background that everybody does on Instagram. Sorry for the uncreativeness, but I'm thinking of doing a room tour. I'm not 100% sure. There's not really much to show, if I'm honest. I didn't know what kind of background to use because there's not a lot of backgrounds in this room. And one of the walls is a horrible blue colour. So don't really want to be showing you guys that. And that takes up like the wall that's like facing the window. So bit of a tough one, but we move. So yeah, you're stuck with uh, this white bed sheet background for now. But today I'm actually coming to show you a wee swimsuit try on haul. So, so this video is luckily in collaboration with Cupshe. As you can see, they are a, I'm going to stop rustling the bag and actually speak. So they're a swimsuit brand and they honestly have the cutest swimming pieces. So I have got a few to show you. I know a lot of people didn't get away during the summer holiday, but I know a lot of people are actually going away now. So I thought, what a perfect time to show everyone different swimsuits that they could wear on holiday and um, different swim pieces that they might bring on holiday because I know a lot of people are getting away to the hot weather because it's starting to get cold here. It's like those mornings where it's like sunny but it's still like freezing cold like it's like three degrees outside but it's sunny so it looks like it's going to be warm and because it's sunny you sweat but you're freezing cold. The logic behind that I don't really understand either. But anyway, let's get into the haul. Before I start, I just wanted to say all the links to all the pieces I'll be wearing will be in the description box down below if you want to buy them or have a look. Even at their website, I'll leave the links below. Look how cute this packaging is. Like, sorry, but how bloody cute is this? They aced it with the packaging. Also, please ignore my nails. Moving boxes and everything, moving into a flat, not a good idea when you've got nails on. I really need them done. Uh, so yeah, let's just ignore that. But yeah, really cute packaging. So starting off with the winner. So the first piece, so cute. So, mm, mm, mm. so it's just, oh, oh, very fancy. So it's just this wee bikini, right? It crosses at the back. That's why it's kind of confusing to hold up. But I'll try it on so you can see, right? Cutest wee pattern ever. Loving like yellow right now. I don't know what it is. Even like it's a summer colour, but it is an autumn colour as well. But yeah, such a cute pattern. I just, I don't know, it gives me like wee picnic, like summery vibes. Um, and then like, so the straps, I don't know how to describe it, like they cross over. So it's like that. I'm not very good at showing this, but it's wee frilly at the bottom. I am not showing this very well, but yeah, it's got all these wee frills at the bottom and it's just so cute. And then the bottoms are just like this. So very cute. They fill at the sides as well. Same pattern. And on the bum as well, they've got this wee ruche just at the very top, which I think is so cute. Also, another thing about these bikinis that I really like, it's padded because I don't know if anybody else finds this, but I don't like bikinis that aren't padded because you're obviously not gonna be wearing a bra underneath. You're going into the ocean. Oceans aren't exactly warm. So you're obviously gonna get stiff. I really like padded bikinis because it hides all that. Um, so yeah, just wanted to let you know these are padded, which is a brilliant, brilliant thing. Okay, so a swimsuit trend that really has come out, I think it came about last year, well that's when I started to notice it anyway, was like t-shirt bikini tops, which I love. So I got this really cute summery pattern, right? It's kind of like, it's florals, right? But kind of reminds me of like lemons, oranges, that kind of thing, right? So it's like a t-shirt, so it's got obviously like the sleeves at the side, they're just really short sleeves, right? But then they tie at the front as well, t-shirt padded, like I swear this is the only t-shirt bikini top that I found that's padded because a lot of them just leave it out because it's like a t-shirt. I don't know. I don't know how to describe it, but this one's padded, winning. And it's as well padded, but you can't see it because I always find as well, if something's tight, you might be able to see like the padded bits. These ones you can. And then the bikini bottoms are just like this. They are a bit higher, which I do really like on some bikinis. Um, and again, just love the pattern of this. They're a really nice shape as well. I don't know. I feel like a shape on a bikini really does matter and padding which I feel like isn't talked about enough like I love padding bikinis and the shape really does matter as well. So these aren't like thong these ones but they're not like granny pants. Nothing against granny pants. I do love a good pair of granny pants but not when it's a bikini. They're just like Brazilian is that the word or is that like really saucy? 
what's it like when it's like in the middle like hot pan no it's not hot pan because that's like shorts it's not i don't know but it's not like round it's like just a v do you know what i mean like that's the shape it's like a v so this one again it's just a wee bikini and it's just it's like this so it's got like the two straps for the arms but they're like frilled as you can tell which i just think is adorable it's like a wee tube kind of um design just kind of like rectangular kind of shape i don't really know again padded which i absolutely love but this one it gets cuter the back is tie up obviously you can't properly see right now because it's not on but i'll show you when i do put it on and it's tie up at the back so it gives a really nice back detail as you can tell it's nice and simple but still effective these bottoms just got wee frills on the side as you can tell which i just absolutely love the shape again is really cute so it's not a thong again but it's kind of like that v kind of shape i really don't know what the name is of it but i just really like the shape it's not just plain white you can probably see but it's kind of got like lines like it's like lines as you can tell which also again makes it like simple but effective i also forgot to mention like these bikinis are so thick like they're not see-through at all so this is obviously white right but it is not see-through at all because sometimes i feel that with um bikinis especially when something's white especially when it gets wet it can go see-through these aren't going see-through honey they are not see-through really good quality which i love this last bikini is probably my favorite bikini because i also feel like you could wear it for more than just a bikini and it's just like this right really cute you could wear this as a top like imagine this to a picnic how cute like i don't know i just think that would be adorable even in autumn like with a pair of jeans big cardigan i don't know i just think that would be really cute um but yeah again padded so nothing showing honey do not worry really good quality it's got a wee frill at the top which i absolutely love the texture of this is just really nice like the pattern of it's just really nice i don't know i just really like it i hope i not mentioned this already the sleeves on these two where it's like strappy sleeves are both adjustable what everyone needs in their life every girl needs adjustable straps on a bikini in their life i hate straps that aren't adjustable they're like high-waisted how cute like with a wee top like i just think that's like so 90s anybody else seen that um again like a checker kind of print really cute the back is a wee bit um not as v-shaped they're a bit more like rounded but still a really nice shape which is good again no see-through but just <laughs> how cute of a bikini is that like just so 90s do you know what i mean like i'm getting like um grease vibes i'm really liking these bikinis i just think they're really cute imagine this on a beach with a wee strawberry daiquiri in the hand so i really hope you all enjoyed my cup she haul again i'll leave all the links to all the bikinis that i wore and showed to you down below i am honestly so impressed with the quality one main thing that i look for in a bikini is if it's padded i don't know why i just find it a big impact especially when you're going in the water you're going to be cold you know what happens so it's really good that the bikini like tops are padded just to cover that up i also think it's so good that the bikini straps like when they're strappy straps they are adjustable because honestly i'm not wanting anything falling out when i'm just having a wee swim that is not a good look i could find everything i was looking for on that website like i was so impressed when i was looking through it so yeah would highly recommend having a look just down below if you're going on holiday that's where to look even next summer even if you're not going on holiday even if you want to order bikinis in your house because you know you're going to go on holiday one day do that that's how you can keep yourself busy during all this coronavirus stuff online shop for bikinis for when you do get to go on holiday but yeah i really hope you enjoyed and make sure to check out all the links in the description box below of all the bikinis i wore i also just link to the website thank you so much to cup for collaborating with me for this video also if you want to see a room tour of my uni flat just let me know in the comments below and i'll make sure to do that for you even though it's not that big of a room if you want to see it you want to see it so just let me know but i hope you enjoyed and i'll hopefully see you soon bye